Hi you guys, welcome to this week's video. I've missed you so much and I'm so happy that you're here today. Um, it's currently Monday, June 7th. It's 3.05 and I take my boards on June 10th. So I'm just a few days away and I just wanted to sit down, give you a short rundown on how I've been feeling and I guess where my headspace is, more or less so I can look back on this video and see how I've made it through this part of my life because it's honestly not been the greatest. So the last few weeks, now that I'm trying to sit here and recall how it's been, I feel like I've forgotten everything and let go of that pain. It's been so depressing and isolating, and I do know that. On Instagram, I mentioned that this process is really dehumanizing, and what I mean by that is that I feel not human. I feel so far removed from society. Being alone and losing your routines, losing your habits, because your whole day revolves around this exam, and it's just... Every day is so repetitive and you don't even know what day it is. You don't know what's going on in the world. You don't know what time it is. I put that pressure on myself because when I have a challenge that's presented to me or when I commit myself, myself to something, I give it my all. I do my best so I don't regret not giving it my all. And I'm always striving to do my best. So I've placed a lot of pressure on myself to do well on this exam and that's okay. I can handle it. There are There were days that have been really hard and I didn't feel like I could make it through. You know, now that I'm sitting here just a few days out from my exam, I don't remember any of the pain that I felt. And I don't know if it's a defense mechanism to just forget about everything and to forget about that pain, but I do know that this time has been very exhausting and I wouldn't wish it upon anyone because it's just not it's not enjoyable. But like I said, I'm so happy to be at the tail end of this. But where I'm at right now, I took my last practice exam today. I've taken all the NBMEs. I've taken UWorlds. You know, did a pass through UWorld and I did a, another half pass through UWorld and I've done a lot. I, I'm going to put a whole video out about how I've studied for boards once I get my score back. I have done so much. I've worked so hard during this time. And I'm very proud of myself. The last few days have been hard because I didn't feel very confident and my brain has felt so fuzzy and tired that I feel like I've been forgetting everything. Last night I've kind of had this switch and I've been waiting for this switch because I've been so stressed and not confident and I know myself really well before exams like this that I have to wait and I have to let that ride out and I can't resist it and then I get to this point where I'm kind of at right now where I'm more relaxed and I accept what I know and I usually say this in my videos but I'm like oh, I accept what I know and I'm confident and I'm ready and I'm turning that stress that distress into a more excitement and I'm excited to take this exam I'm excited to be over I feel I'm working on the confidence part that'll come within the next few days I'm just changing my perspective and I've been waiting for this moment and I knew it would come within the next few days. There's so much that I don't know and I'm reminded of that every single day, but I do know a lot and I know so much more than I have before. It's insane. I feel like this point in my life right now, this is the most knowledge that I will know at one point. Seriously, my brain's just overflowing with information. It's disgusting. I love you so much and I thank you so much for sticking around and being so supportive during this time. A lot of you guys have been messaging me on Instagram and giving me so much support and I love you guys so much and I appreciate your presence more than you know. I'm so excited to, to be back and to move forward from this time and to give you everything that I know about how to study for this exam to share success with you and to see you guys be successful in this too. Ah, I'm gonna leave on that note and get back to studying. I love you guys so much and yeah, until next time, take care of yourselves, be kind to yourselves, continue to work hard and all that good stuff. Okay, bye!